Hey guys, thanks for joining me for another Dokkan Battle video, and today we're going to do some attempts against uh, Red Zone Fusion Zamasu. Uh, this is probably one of, still one of the hardest fights on Global, um, and we're going to try to beat him with Universe 6. Now, I've been working on this one for the past couple of days, um, and I've tried different types of team comps. I really, I really wanted it to work with Tech Khalifa's SSR, um, but how it works out is she... Ah, uh, she ends up with what, like 78% chance to dodge, which is pretty good, but you would not believe how much she still gets hit. And because she's just an SSR, um, what really hurts the team is her HP is super low. And if she just gets touched by a normal, like you're obliterated. So even though she has a high chance to dodge at 78, if she doesn't, you're basically dead, right? So I'm going to do some attempts today with a slightly different approach. We are going to run Boda Megetta. Now, the risk here with Boda Megetta is I have Boda Megetta in Vados, um, which does take my normal EZA Tech Khalifa below 100% chance to dodge. It's still like 96%, but with my luck, she's going to get tagged. <laughs> we'll see. Um, and then the other strat I've been trying here is the last phase of this Samastu fight is physical, and we all know what a god Kefla is. And so what I have been doing for most of my attempts is instead of running a double Kale team, I am running one Kale leader with one Kefla leader. So I am, you know, losing 30% on leader skill, but I get to run two Keflas, um, which I think is really the key to winning this fight is running double Kefla. So let's go ahead and hop in. Um, <clears throat> and there's no way in heck I'm going for a no item run. Uh, I just want to get a victory with Universe 6. Now, it's crazy because I feel like Universe 6 has gotten a lot of buffs and they feel a lot better. But man, this same fight with my Dragon Ball Saga team, I beat like first try. So it just goes to show you um, that that Dragon Ball Saga team is still so crazy. Now here, I'll have to decide what to do because realistically, um, I want to keep Kefla on rotation. Um, but Kale and Khalifla together is just too good, right? But I feel like I'm going to do this. I, I do feel like we got to keep Kefla. Because if we keep a Kefla on each side of the rotation, um, then we always have just like godly onslaughts of attacks coming in. Um, and I think that's what we want. Um, I'm good with five orbs. I would have liked to have gotten six, but we'll take five. Um, and I feel like I, I just kind of have to weese right away. The AoEs are too ridiculous. Um, the hope is, and kind of what I've been doing on my runs, is trying to get by with one weese on this phase. Um, and get through. Yeah, see, right. Wait, did she already took, she took an AOE. It, it, did I not see that correctly? Hold on. Or was that somebody else getting hit? Did Tech Khalifa already get hit when she's at like 96% chance to dodge? Um, I may have missed saw that, but I could have sworn that's what I saw there. Uh, she better dodge. This is a, a super attack. Okay. I was going to say, <laughs> maybe that was Kefla that got hit. I don't know. Yeah, she better just be dodging like everything at 96%. I still expect it to basically be 100%, right? I just thought there's that slight chance that I could get tagged, and it's going to be really annoying. Um, yeah, and then Kefla only getting one super really hurts there. Um, not getting the sixth orb really hurt because we didn't get the guaranteed additional, and then it, we weren't able to proc our hidden potential additional. So that really hurts. Kale here getting some additionals, though, I think will help. But yeah, we got to push as much damage through as quickly as possible. Because when we get, like, next turn, we're still going to have Whis on. But the following turn, I don't want to have to yet use another Whis, right? Um, so here, I'm guessing, you know, STR Kefla is probably the better play with the dodge in slot one. Uh, we are getting plenty of... Or oh, I should have... I mean, I should have saved those for Kale to, like, heal. But um, I kind of feel like I just needed to make sure I got the orbs there. We'll see what happens. Uh, Boda Megetta is going to get hit, which will increase his attack and defense. He'll be guarding, by the way. Uh, Kefla, you want to dodge, please. Thank you. Taking 100, uh, taking 100k normals with a Whis on is crazy. This has to be a dodge. It's not, so we're dead, huh? That's attempt one down the drain. All right. So the thing I notice about this U6 girl team, it's way... The reason why the Dragon Ball Saga team, I found it so much easier, it's way less RNG dependent than this team, right? Like, you need so much more RNG. And then this is kind of how my fights are. They just go really quick and I try. There was two runs where I thought I had it. I was literally one dodge away from winning and stinking, you know, Tech Khalifa, you know, SSR at 78% didn't dodge. Like, it, it was so stupid. I, I had this fight won, I think, on two different attempts. Uh, and we were just one dodge away and, and it was unfortunate. Because here's the thing. You'll see this. It's like really a struggle at first. 
But once we get into super, if I can get the phase two, right? And we're looking at super saiyan one or two Kefla, like we start to steamroll and we just have to make sure it's like, you know, the wrong unit, not just getting hit. Now this is interesting because the group attack is coming after. I mean, I guess we have to do, I mean, only getting fierce battle. I mean, I don't think I want to do double Kefla together. Um, so we'll do this. I mean, we definitely have to Whis, right? Like any of these units get touched. We don't dodge. We're screwed. Uh, that, that's the, the thing is, is too much of this team is dodge or die. That's why it, it's a little bit of a struggle right now. Uh, cause look at that. Yeah. 120 K normals with Whis. Like, come on, come on. It, and it's got a lot of buildup units, right? Like Kefla's got to build up a little bit. STR Kale's got to build up a little bit. It's got too much buildup. So yeah, this is a tough fight for this team. Uh, but darn it if we're not going to try to get it done here, right? So this video is going to go up whether I'm successful or not. Um, cause I don't want to waste the record time. So we'll just see. And then you guys can let me know if you get gotten it done with universe six or not, or if you've tried different strategies. And of course, Vados, it's so crazy. We have like such high dodge chance and how often they actually don't dodge just drives me crazy. Just drives me crazy how often these units don't dodge. And it's not even just that they have like 70% chance to dodge, but then they've also got like 30 dodge hidden potential. And like, just like how, how are they getting hit? <laughs> the RNG is just terrible. Um, and this is going to be a rough run because sometimes I've just died on rotations, right? Like the rotations are just terrible. Now this one, I think, are we going to have Tech Kale and STR? Yeah, we're going to have Tech Kale and STR Khalifa together. So this next rotation is actually looking pretty good. Kale's going to be guarding. We're going to have Whis up. The two Keflas did push through like half of his damage. Ah, we kind of need a dodge here, actually. Please? Oh my gosh. Okay, we still survived because it was actually after she attacked, which helps, but we're like near death. Um, so we need to do this. And of course we have like no orbs in sight we can heal with, huh? Like just literally nothing. We can drop one AGL orb. Great. I guess I will take it. Cause yeah, there's, I mean, there's, I mean, the run's probably dead. I could use another Whis. Do I need, yeah. Cause AGL Kale is just going to die in the first group attack, right? So I guess the run's over if I don't. Cause well, what's her defense? 260k with one Whis, like, is she still taking 100k? Probably. Kale's probably going to be fine. Khalifa should, be... all right, we'll just use the second Whis. Like, it's going to be a dead run anyways, because if I don't use the Whis, I think I'm dead. I'm pretty sure if I don't use the Whis, I'm just dead anyways. So I might as well use it and at least get an attempt at the next phase, right? Maybe we'll get lucky in there. I guess it's better to use two Weeses on this phase when I know the run's going to die if I don't than to just let the run die. So we'll see. Maybe we'll, I mean, once again, if we can really cook in phase two with STR Kefla, I mean, that's what we need, right? We need a Kefla to go crazy in phase two. So let's see if we can get it done. This is attempt two out of five for the day. Uh, this will be really nice too because we are literally like two days away from the power level update where it will allow me to have more attempts because of my power level, which is awesome. Um, cause if I don't have this run done, then I definitely going to get in, but I am fairly confident. This is the team build. I want to beat it with, um, LR Cal and Khalifa, I don't think are the answer. Um, they're just so weak early on. They're too weak early on. I want tech Khalifa's SSR to be the answer, but she's so, she just crushes your team HP so much, right? She's literally got like 9,000 HP or something. And Bota Magetta has got like 20,000 HP. So like the team HP is so much better. And because we're running one Kefla lead, like we even more need the HP because we're not even running a full 200% leader, right? Uh, let's see if I AGL Kale can put through some, yeah, because we're at almost 600k HP, right? I think one of my runs, we were literally at like 530, 540 HP, like, ugh. all right. So we're getting into Super Saiyan Kefla. Um, that was a double Whis turn. So now we're under single Whis right now, which should be fine. I guess Bodum again in slot one's probably what I want, huh? Um, cause he's going to get a defense. Yeah. I mean, I think that's the way to go there. And then eight orbs should be plenty. Of course, like we just can't line up any healing orbs. Um, we'll see. I mean, I feel like we shouldn't die here provided Vados is going to die. Sure. Before Boda Magetta gets the defense. I mean, this is actually still going to sting because Boda Magetta doesn't have his defense. Yeah. 20. Come on, Zamasu. Like chill X, man. Just being a jerk has to immediately super before we have a chance to do anything. And then, okay, Vados is just going to kill the run. Like, seriously, she has 70% chance to dodge with like 31 hidden potential dodge. 
And you just can't even... Like... <laughs> So, once again, the team is very capable of winning this fight. There's just too many RNG factors to... Like, it's definitely not consistent, right? Like, we're, we're definitely not going to consistently win, but we got to get this W. Um, oh, and I keep forgetting to switch this because I do. Once again, I'm not afraid to use items. Uh, we are going to run the Universal Survival Saga Equip. And to me, this isn't even, like, cheating, you know, for people that like to know item stuff. But using this support memory, I mean, since we're not running a 200% lead, I'm kind of using that to compensate. And then you just have to have Whis anyways, right? So, all right, try number three. First real attempt. Now that I actually have the support memory on that I, I literally went to the Baba shop to buy more of those just for these runs. And I uh, completely forgot to uh, put it on there. I, I do not like getting the double Kefla, you know, I would, I mean, this is going to be a strong, like we're going to deal a lot of damage here. This is going to be a strong rotation damage wise. Um, but I would like to see the Kefla split up. Um, I guess we'll have to get, five orbs looks good there um um i don't think we're gonna get six if we drop them so i'll just take the single orb yeah we have five on either side we'll take the five at least we have the dodge but we don't have the guaranteed additional with either of these keflas dodge please my goodness with the weiss 80 clean normals man yeah like this team is definitely locked lacking the slot one units right we got tech Khalifla. And then I'm guessing Boda Magetta would be the other, but I really don't want to keep him in on rotation. Um, this STR Kale is a slot one unit, but she's not on turn one, right? And there isn't a lot of time. This is a fast fight. There is not a lot of time to build up. Uh, the more supers we can get here, the better. Stacking defense. And keep in mind, Kale is not guarding because we don't have a Khalifla. I almost wish Kale's passive was Khalifla or Kefla because... You know, as we get into the game, if we're going to want to run these double Kefla rotations, like, running Kale's going to be hard because you need a Khalifla. And without the guard, Kale just got killed. So, sure. That was death by rotation. There wasn't anything we could do there. Here is attempt four out of five. <laughs> Come on. We got to get this done. We got to get this done. Um, and I kind of wanted to record it live because, honestly, I was so tired of, like, saving all these failed runs on my phone and then having to delete them. So... We're, we're going to get it done. All right, here we go again. Uh, we're praying for a better rotation, please. Um, yes, this is okay. I Actually, I really like this rotation because we're going to have Khalifla in slot one to dodge. Kefla in slot two. Now watch, this be the turn that Khalifla gets hit with only like a 6% chance to get hit, right? Um, we still, once again, we're still dependent on Kefla and Vados dodging, right? No, I didn't mean to hit auto battle. Okay, hold on. Oof. Uh, use the Whis. It was only uh, Khalifa's attack, but yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay. Um, and it doesn't matter for in orbs right now. Um, we're going to get rid of these physical orbs, I think. All right. Will my units dodge for me? That is the question, right? If Khalifa even gets hit once by normal, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> yeah, Khalifa, you better not. All right. We got to dodge. Hey, look at that. We're doing what we're supposed to do. Maybe it's a sign that this is the run. Because Khalifa's type disadvantage, right? We're counting on her... 96% chance to dodge to not fail. Watch. Watch this hit, you guys. Watch this hit. She's literally at 96. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say. She better still basically be 100%, right? Basically, the odds of her getting hit are like, you know, truce units with the three dodge. Like, it, it will happen once in a while, but it better not. <laughs> right? Um, all right. So, here we are. Was that 14 mil right away? Yeah, dude. Kefla's cooking right off the bat here. See, this is the other reason this was nice. We got a good linking partner for Kefla, and we got support. Um, the, and Kefla got the guaranteed additional. We just didn't get hidden potential. So Kefla cooked there a little bit. Um, I think between Kefla and Kale, if we get lucky with their additionals, we can maybe finish this guy off. And that's kind of what we're hoping for. Um, I actually am going to put Boda Magetta in slot one. Boda Magetta, I mean, they better not immediately super me, but at least he's guarding. So, I mean, he's still the better one to put there. Um, can I drop the orbs properly? I wish I could get these red ones without getting the rainbow. Um, Dropping that, I mean, we'll try this, I guess. I feel like it's not going to drop good. Oh, it dropped terribly. I guess we get the three orbs, we still get the dodge. So I guess, I mean, that's fine. If we weren't going to get six, I mean, getting three is fine. All right, good. He took a normal. So we got the defense up at least. That is good. So Boda Magetta now I'm feeling good. Like if Boda Magetta should be able to eat the super now. Like, that should be, yeah, double digits. We're good now. And then a dodge. And then Kale's going to take damage. Yeah, that, I mean, we just can't avoid it. Kale, like, has the super. Um, yeah, I think Boda Magetta's going to be fine here, right? 
I mean, this is your job, Bodomageta, please. Yeah, 60k with the weeks. We'll take it. All right. This might be the run. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, more RNG still to come. But all right. Yeah, we need. There we go. Kefla getting the hidden potential additional saving me because I didn't get lucky with the orbs. Big damage. There we go. All right. We need Kale to pop off a few now. All right, Kale. Let's go. All right, 8 mil. We need some additionals from you, Kale. We need one of these, like, relentless turns. Because I, I don't want to have to use a Whis on the next turn. Yep, give me another one. Okay. Give me a crit with it. I think we're going to need a triple out of Kale here. But if we can get this Zamasu, we're going to be in a good place. And I've gotten to this place before. Physical Zamasu with a Whis. Okay. I still had two health bars. I mean, if we get a crit, maybe. If not, he's going to have a sliver, and we're just going to pray we can get that hit in. If he better not AoE, yeah. Yeah. Oh, she did have another one, but it wasn't a super. Wow, Kale, okay, you did what you needed there. Um, there's no way we can waste a Whis here when he's got a sliver. Please not in slot one. Please not in slot one. Um, okay. We have a decision to make here, right? We can obviously put Tech Khalifla in slot one, right? Very easy play there. Um... But she's probably going to deal zero damage and he's going to get to attack. Actually, I think I'm going to put STR Kale there. We're going to move Kefla like this. STR Kale with 400k defense and guard. Would she still die on a super? I don't know. But we're without Whis. But this, I think, is the safest play. Because this is the most defensive unit. Unless I want to put Kale there or Kefla. But I didn't have the orbs for dodging. I could put Khalifla there. But then we're going to let the AoE go off. And I don't want the AoE to go off. So I think we're going to try this. All right, do not super her right away. Okay, we're good. And then Kale should have some additionals. I think we got this with Kale. Yep, okay, perfect. And she's like basically a guaranteed crit unit, right? Okay, so now this we're in the <laughs> the forbidden zone, right? Like physical Zamasu, like he hits really hard, but he's at least single target. And I feel like that's more manageable, right? But once again, any of these units takes the wrong hit and we're dead. So, Bodomageta is guarding at 400k defense. So, I mean, we, we rock it like this. Um, we use the Whis here. We get... is absolutely far. Now, we hope that Kefla just cooks and go, goes crazy. Um, I will take the healing. I feel like the orbs are going to drop well. Yeah. Um, oh, only four? I kind of want to soft reset that. Because the orbs are better. Because we, we want the... Well... We want the guaranteed additionals with Kefla. I guess we'll ride it. I won't soft reset. I thought they were going to drop a little bit better. Um, I mean, I kind of want to leave those eight up orbs up for Kefla. Once again, all it takes, though, is, you know, Zamasu supers Vados and she doesn't dodge and we die, right? Like, as good as the run is going, it just can end so easily on one missed dodge, right? Once again, it's that RNG factor. Like, Kefla here, I think Kefla will take... Yeah, Kefla is guarding... And she's supered, so she will tank a super with the Whis for sure. But we need her to go crazy. Yeah, only one super because of the orbs. Dang it. See, uh, our best defense right now is offense. Like, getting this guy out of here as quick as possible. Kefla only getting the one super hurts. And, of course, <sighs> Vados, Vados dodge. But, like, once again, that was a run ender right there. So what's going to happen is, is I don't think there's any way we kill him here. So then we go into the like really crazy RNG zone where like we've got to dodge everything, otherwise we're dead. Um, Kale actually getting a transformation pretty rare. Um, and then actually, I think I'm liking STR Kale there with guard. We'll let her. I mean, this this is going to be a very offensive turn. I mean, we could really put up some damage here. So let's let Kale. Oh shoot. Oh no. Okay. I was gonna say we don't have Khalifla, but she's type advantage, so she's still guarding. So yeah, we got eight orbs there. Okay, I mean, if they super kill right away, I mean, he's probably going to super, right? Oh, we're going to die on a super. 20k normals. I think we're going to die. Don't super her. I think we made it through, right? Okay, now give me a couple supers here. Stack your defense because I need you to be able to survive a super with this Whis here, please. Oh, this run might actually be it, you guys. We might be looking good here because Kefla's going to go crazy. And then Kale might actually be able to... I, I don't think we're going to finish, but we're going to put a big dent here. We still need the Mega RNG, though, but this this might be a run here. This might be the one. Okay, yeah, 20 mil. See, when we get Kefla in this mode, because next turn we're going to have another crazy Kefla, and if I need to, I might just put Kefla in slot one and hope she dodges. We might. We'll see. Actually, no. Next turn, will I have Tech Khalifa? I might. I think we will. Tech Khalifa slot one. Kefla slot two. 
We're going to be bringing some damage next turn. And then we hope that Khalifa gets supered. Yeah, look, we're peeling through Zamasu. We might actually get this. We might actually get this, you guys. Because we've got Whis on. Kefla and Kale, I think, can take the super. Look at her go. Oh, I thought she was going to give me another one. All right, Kale, give me one of the crazy nasty turns. Let's just take him out. Oh, guys, I think we got it. <laughs> I think we got it. Oh, yo, we got it. Let's go. We got it. Universe 6. No problem, right? Universe 6 taken down Fusion Zamasu Red Zone. We got it, you guys. We got it. We got it. Let me know if you guys have attempted this run, but whew, we'll show the team build. I think this is the victory lap right here. You know what? I'm going to friend request you. Thank you for your Kefla. We appreciate you right now. So that was the team build. I mean, we had to go use all the items, right? But I think this is the strat that some people might not realize to do. Get two Keflas on the team. She is busted. Uh, we brought the damage through. Uh, we got it done. So anyways, guys, let me know what you think of this uh, fight. Let me know what you thought of this video. Thanks for watching. We'll catch y'all on the next one.